exclusive, Helen Mirren shocks the world by calling the traitorous devil responsible for the Queen's death. William and Kate moved during speech at BAFTA. Hello, noble subjects and curious people from around the world. If you're fascinated by royalty and want to stay up to date on the latest news and gossip, this is the right channel for you. So, subscribe now to not miss any episodes and stay informed about everything happening in the world of royalty. At the prestigious event held at the Royal Festival Hall of the South Bank Centre in London, many celebrities attended to celebrate the film and television industry. But it was Helen Mirren's striking speech that stole the show. The renowned actress surprised everyone by denouncing a traitorous devil who caused the death of Queen Elizabeth II in September 2022. During her emotional speech, the actress revealed the long-standing relationship between BAFTA and Her Majesty, who supported more than 50 cultural organizations over the years. And it was thanks to the Queen's exceptional sponsorship of the film and television industries that Helen Mirren was honored with a BAFTA in 2013. But the real revelation shocked everyone when Helen Mirren called the person responsible for the Queen's death a traitorous devil. William and Kate were visibly moved while the clip that was being played in support of Helen's speech featured the voice of Her Majesty. Don't miss this bombshell. Watch the full video now and find out who the traitorous devil responsible for the death of Queen Elizabeth II is. During her speech at the BAFTA, Helen Mirren moved everyone with inspiring words about the importance of art and culture. In a segment played during the event, the actress emphasized how the creative genius of artists such as writers, actors, filmmakers, dancers, and musicians allows us to see both cultural diversity and our shared humanity. And it was with an emotional tribute to Queen Elizabeth II that Helen concluded her speech, Your Majesty, you are the leading star of the nation. On behalf of BAFTA, thank you for everything you have done for our film and television industry. Loving service leaders are still rare, but in all cases, those who serve will be loved and remembered when those who cling to power and privilege have forgotten. True lips endure forever, but a lying tongue is only for a moment. Deceit is in the heart of those who plan evil but those who promote peace have joy. The studio was filled with emotion after Dame Helen Mirren's moving speech honoring Queen Elizabeth II at the BAFTA. The most memorable moment was when Richard, one of the hosts, thanked Her Majesty for her support of the film and television industry, leaving everyone in silence before an emotional round of applause. But what no one expected was that the speech would be controversial on social media, with many speculating that the references to traitors and liars were actually aimed at Meghan and Harry. The real humiliation for the couple is that they have been criticized for their attitude towards the royal family for two years, and now they are at the center of jokes. It's hard to imagine that Harry is not bitterly regretting his actions, especially after the tragic loss of his grandfather and grandmother. As the camera moves through the audience, we can see William and Kate applauding the speech with emotion. And the surprise of the night was the presence of the Prince and Princess of Wales, who hadn't attended the event since 2020. The couple attended the ceremony and met with category winners and Rising Star Award nominees. The 2023 BAFTA was truly a night of intense emotions and unexpected twists.